And check in now with Chief Meteorologist Scott Paget uh, with a look at uh, the latest forecast and the latest uh, path that uh, Harvey's on right now. Harvey's still a tropical storm. Want to get right to it to give you the latest information. You can see as we take it you, that Harvey has continued to push its way to the north northeast. That northwest side still seeing some heavier rain in north and west sides now of Louisiana, just southeast of Shreveport, seeing some of the heavier rain that is holding on near Port Arthur, near Beaumont, starting to see some light rain holding on, but seeing rain all the way from near Atlanta, stretching all the way back to that center of circulation. More than 550 miles away because of Harvey that is now pushing its way inland. So we will continue to watch Harvey erratically move its way to the north and to the northeast. So that's what we've been watching with Harvey so far that center of circulation about 50 miles north of Lake Charles and is pushing northeast. Pretty quick, well, about eight miles per hour. We'll pick up forward speed and downgrade to a tropical depression as we go through the next couple of days. Then through the weekend in parts of Ohio, even stretching into West Virginia as it's raining itself out. How much rain have we seen? We had to kind of group this by tens almost. As you take a look near the Houston area, stretching up to near Port Arthur, Beaumont area, seeing 35 to 50 inches of rain. Baytown 51.88. At last check, Beaumont at 47.28 inches, more than 47 inches. And going through the next couple of days, maybe a couple more inches down near Port Arthur, but watch as that track pushes northeast, possibly six inches of rain near Monroe, Louisiana. Memphis, possibly seven inches of rain. Same story near Nashville, seven and a half inches. Even Lexington, Kentucky, seeing three and a half inches of rain, which could cause some localized flooding. But also the tropics are heating up. Tropical storm Irma, well out in the East Atlantic, possibly will be our next hurricane. Latest update has it as a category two hurricane still well east of the Lesser Antilles by Monday afternoon. We'll keep our eye on that. But the peak of hurricane season, we are almost there. The peak of hurricane season is September 11th. So we're just getting right into that peak of a hurricane season. And we could see a couple more storms on the horizon. Uh, hopefully done in the Gulf. Seven day forecast shows that here in North Texas we dry out nicely. Temperatures in the low 90s. We've been relatively dry. Small rain chances through your holiday weekend on Labor Day 92 degrees. Rain chances at 20%. Next Tuesday and Wednesday, rain chances bumping back up, but highs remaining in the low 90s.